Hello there and welcome to the wonderful world of Wisley in December. Hey. <laughs> Hello Lorna, the lovely Lorna. We are in uh, Wisley's exotic planted garden and uh, what I wanted to ask you is what would be, if you wanted to plant up your own uh, tropical effect cold hardy exotic garden what would be your top five plants to plant in that <laughs> mm. oh this tetrapanic rex t-rex it looks like a dinosaur footprint it's amazing i absolutely love this plant i mean there is nothing that isn't exotic, isn't crazy. It's got everything you need. It's got big leaves, it's got lobing, it's absolutely fantastic. T-Rex, I would have that. Do you know what, I think that, we all know, reading textbooks, that T-Rex has got the second largest growing leaf plant it's amazing. in growing a country. That's got to be one of the largest leaves I've seen on the T-Rex. Uh, my second choice. I was going to ask you, what is your second choice? Banana. Banana. I mean, it looks so exotic. I mean, it looks fabulous. I mean, you've got a big stand of bananas here. They're starting to wrap them, but these, these are fabulous. I mean, look at this, look at this stand of banana here. I mean, I try to stand under it and show how This is, I mean, if this doesn't feel exotic, then there's something wrong with you. Exactly, yeah. Absolutely. You know, and it's pretty much, I wouldn't say bulletproof, but it's, it's as hardy a banana as you're going to get. Yeah. It has an absolutely fantastic uh, architectural look. And um, yeah, so I, distinctive. I, yeah. You can pick it out in the garden. Can, it's, it's so bright, so green. And the leaves are just so unique. Absolutely superb. Okay, so done uh, one and two on your list, which was the uh, Touch of Panics and the Musa Bazdu. What else is in your top five plants for? your exotic garden it's a plant i really fell in love with coming here in this exotic garden and i just can't help but love them now it's the bootia oh it's a great Look choice absolutely amazing it's the curve the curve on the leaf that gets me absolutely very distinct it goes up and then curves right round really distinctive lovely sort of what i call a glock of blue it gets that amazing color amazing shape superb so what have you got to show us for number four on your list uh, must have the next topic garden the ginger oh yeah let's have a look da, 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 da. And like, I mean, it's not a canna, it's not a banana, but it's got those amazing green scrap white leaves. It looks superb. Mm. The flowers are so exotic. And I think any exotic garden has to have a ginger. Absolutely superb. I mean, they look great. This one, this one's looking great. It's got the buds on it. Very, very robust, very exotic. Yeah, I mean they're not in flower now because it is in the middle of December. Oh, it's December. Uh, but even so, they it looks vibrant. It looks lush. You know, you got, you got the, the it promise. Just, you don't of need the flowers on it. It's the foliage. Yeah, is I, I agree. It's a great, great choice. Okay, so that's four out of five. So you think about it. What is your? Well, we're gonna. There's a lot to choose from. Moses. <laughs> the, the river bank. Okay. Wrapped up in a little crib. Right. Here we go. I know what this is. You know where I am. This. I could be on the banks of Egypt, papyrus. Absolutely fantastic. It yeah. just grows, it likes wet conditions, but here it is and it's growing away. We have some for garden, but I mean, this is absolutely fantastic. It looks so exotic, so easy to grow. Yeah. Absolutely love it. I don't it. think so it's uh, a true papyrus because it's Cyprus papyrus, I believe. Ah, um, is but he telling me this isn't on the banks of Egypt? Uh, no, no, not this oh, one. But it's really, really it's hardy, so and uh, and there's nothing else that looks like that. So I'm going to say, it's amazing. That's your top five. I reckon that's a really good selection of plants. So well done. Thank you very much. Thank you very much for sharing to our viewers the top five key plants for the cold hardy, cold hardy tropical effect exotic garden. Can't get any more words in, could you? No. <laughs>